Baby bus. Let's go share it, Labrador. The case of the backpack theft in the park. Hey now, Lab, I can't believe you said we were going away on the weekend. But instead of being able to relax, we have to work overtime. <laughs> Come on, Doby. Check it out. What a beautiful view of the park. Tell me about it. But now, we have to look after so many children. Ah! I'm not even in the mood to enjoy the view. My legs are weak after I cycled around the park five times on a pedicab carrying those kids so they could enjoy the view. <laughs> Come on, Doby. One Sunday afternoon, Ms. Lop Rabbit decided to take the students on an outing in a park. To ensure their safety, Sheriff Labrador invited Officer Doberman to come along, as he was popular with the kids. Officer Doberman! Sheriff Labrador! Hey now, here I come! Do you want another ride on my bike, Taxi Snowball? No, 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 no. It's, it's about our backpacks. They're missing. What? La la la? Snowball the lamb pointed to a bench not far away and looked anxious. I was going to get some snacks for my backpack. When I got to the pavilion, I found that all the bags were gone. I know you're really good at solving cases, Officer Doberman. Can you help us find our backpacks? Um, I don't think they just vanished into thin air. I mean, might those bags have been stolen by a thief? Hey now, it's finally my time to shine. Leave it to me. I'll be sure to get those bags back. Officer Doberman rubbed his hands together eagerly. Then he and Sheriff Labrador headed to the pavilion. They took out their magnifying glasses and did a fingertip search of the area. However, they didn't find any footprints or marks. Officer Doberman scratched his head at a loss. Hey now, I didn't find a single clue. How will we find the thief? Come on, Doby. Let's put our thinking caps on and try something else to find the thief. Now, you see, the thief must need a vehicle large enough to hide and transport those bags. But cars are not allowed to enter the park. Aha! So, the only vehicle the thief could have used is the- Hey now, hey now, I got it! In that case, the thief must have used a pedicab and hidden the backpacks on it! That's right! Doby, we need to keep an eye out for every pedicab in the park. Maybe the thief is in one of them. Sheriff Labrador and Officer Doberman searched around the park where many of the tourists were laughing and joking, having a good time while riding in pedicabs. Then suddenly, one of the tourists caught Sheriff Labrador's eye, and his dark round eyes instantly glistened. Doby, look over there. What? Most of the tourists are enjoying the scenery while riding the pedicabs at a very leisurely pace. Yes, I see that. But there's one pedicab speeding toward the exit gate of the park. I don't think the rider is enjoying the view. It looks more like he's, he's trying, trying to, to get, get away. away. Hey now, that's very strange indeed. Lab, let's go over and have a look. Sheriff Labrador and Officer Doberman immediately rushed towards that pedicab. They found a pony riding the pedicab without a single passenger on the back. Instead, there was a large white sheet covering something. Sir, stop right there, please. Upon hearing the command, Pony Tenor stopped and turned around impatiently. Jeez, who, uh, uh, Sher Sh Sheriff Labrador and, uh, and Officer Doberman? <laughs> Pony Tenor, why did you bring a sheet to the park? Uh, well, this, uh, this is my new bed sheet. <laughs> and, and I brought it to the park uh, for a little joyride. <laughs> Sheriff Labrador gave Officer Doberman a wink. Then the latter nodded immediately, and he exclaimed in an exaggerated voice, Oh my God, your sheet is covered in dust. Huh? Let me dust it off. Drat! It was you. Hey, now, you stole kids' bags. How could you do something so mean? Stupid cops. I can't believe you found me. <laughs> but don't forget, I'm on a pedicab now. <laughs> With a sly smile, Pony Tenor suddenly began to pedal furiously. The pedicab sped off, its wheels spinning. Catch him, Doby. Hmm. Let me show him what I've got. I'm something of a master cyclist myself after having ridden around the park five times in a row today. 
Without hesitation, Officer Doberman hopped on another pedicab to chase Pony Tenor, riding off with Sheriff Labrador on the back. Huh, with my speed, there's no way you can catch me! A smirk <laughs> spread across Pony Tenor's face, but he was so intent on getting away that he didn't notice that one of those backpacks on the back of the pedicab had slipped off the seat. The long straps of the bag swayed in the wind and got caught in one of the wheels of the pedicab. Slow down! You're in danger! Pony Tenor, stop right now! Danger? <laughs> Come on, there's nothing more dangerous than getting caught! Suddenly, the straps from one of the backpacks got caught in a wheel of the pedicab Pony Tenor was riding. Huh? Then Pony Tenor ah! lost control of the pedicab, causing it to tip over. Pony Tenor fell to the ground ouch, with a thud. Ouch, ouch. A huge knot the size of an egg Please, popped ouch, up on his head. Oh, that hurt! Ah, oh, oh. <sighs> Pony Tenor, you can't be too careful when riding on any sort of wheeled vehicle. When the straps of clothing or backpacks get caught in the wheels, there is the danger of losing control of the bike and possibly injuring yourself. Pony Tenor rubbed his head and nodded. Hey now, why did you steal the children's backpacks, Pony Tenor? I, I, I thought these bags looked nice, so I stole them and planned to sell them. <laughs> Pony Tenor, you are suspected of theft. Come with me to the police station. <laughs> Mini episode on safety. Woof. Woohoo! This pedicab ride is so much fun. You rock, Officer Doberman! <laughs> oh, Gray Donkey, please tuck those broken straps on your backpack inside. Otherwise, we'll both be in danger. Yup, that was a good reminder, Doby. Time to learn safety with Sheriff Labrador. Never put your feet near the wheels when riding a bike, or your feet could easily get caught and injured. Yes, that's right! To avoid losing control of your bike, possibly causing it and you to tip over and hit the ground, don't carry anything that might get stuck in the wheels. Kids, please keep that in mind when you're out there on the road. <laughs>